everybody here we go uhc this is technically our take two there were some issues with take one so i'm about to start the code in three two one all right here we go all right i am at the top of a mountain this is not a good place to start a uhc Please tell me this is a normal oak tree. It is a normal oak tree. Ha ha ha. Yep. So we had some issues on the first one. Some people were not seeing the episode marks. And some people were dying really quickly. And that's just a 1.9 thing. Alright. World Border is right there and it's moving in. And I cannot type. Alright, so let's try and get some apples really quickly, because that world border is coming in. Alright, so I gotta get food, I gotta get apples. No apples out of this tree. Perfect. Brilliant brilliant start to UHC. Alright, I gotta get some more oak trees. There's another one that looks like down here. So, how's everyone go doing? I can tell you right now, I'm not doing so well. Uh, my, my UHC timer wasn't working. Uh, I was down to half a heart in the first three minutes of the first UHC. Uh, got trapped in some water with two skellies didn't turn out so well people were getting blown up by creepers so like i said take two this is our so long jonathan uhc uh, he's joining the coast guard which is amazing good for him uh certainly something i would probably never do uh not that i have any problem with it it's just not my thing having a little bit of block lag hopefully that doesn't affect too much I always feel bad when we have to restart a UHC because people were settled in, people were getting good spawns, uh, BBS found in Notch Apple, um, but we're going to make do with what we can. Hopefully I don't suffer the same fate I did last time. There's a bigger, alright, there's a cave. That was my downfall last time. Okay, that just kind of goes all the way through. So I really maybe don't need to worry about that. If I hear any arrows, I am booking it so fast. If I hear bones or if I get shot at all, I'm leaving this area and never returning. All right, I need to make a crafting bench. I was kind of hoping to not uh, show stuff but it's too late at this point i accidentally must have opened my inventory at some point but you know it is what it is i'll show them everything i'll show them what i got loving is what i got remember that once again maybe a little bit of block lag not really sure i uh, can't reach that one Alright, this is a big oak tree. Hopefully, some apples get dropped soon. I just gotta take out all the leaves first. We are playing in 1.9, and that's why skellies were an issue. But, this time around, I will be prepared. Once again, a little bit of block lag. I gotta get at least one apple before I head down, and I gotta make sure that the world border isn't closing in on me, and I need food. I didn't see any kind of animal.
I don't see any kind of animal around here. Um, I'm going to let that tree despawn while I hunt for animals. Looks like other people are finding them. All right, there's some pigs right here. There are some horses down there, but we've already agreed to not, uh, not do horses as much. Uh, just because they are very buggy in this one, and you can turn invisible on a horse um, if you're riding it. There's some more pigs over there, but I gotta check this tree. Might cut down a few more. I'm gonna cut down this one as well. See what I can get. Eight pork chops. Surprisingly, in a UHC, your hunger doesn't go down as much as you think it would, and that's just probably because of the hunger thing. I mean, the health thing. See if anyone's, no one's taking damage yet. Um, where was that tree? Oh, the big one right here. All right, not seeing any immediate apples. But that's not meaning that aren't, they aren't gonna drop soon. Some more wood I gotta knock out so the leaves will decay. Alright. Hopefully that'll get me something. Playing with Optifine. I love the way this grass looks. I really do. It's so great. Uh, one thing you'll probably notice at some point is that I've been slowly creating a texture pack. Not making it for any like big projects or anything. Uh, just really to see if I could do it. So I've changed the texture of a few things. I've changed the texture of like diamonds, uh, diamond ore blocks. Um, nothing that'll, like nothing cheaty, nothing that'll make me, nothing that'll give me an advantage in the game, but definitely just an improvement on the graphics and stuff. Uh, also like redstone ore, I messed with a little bit. Nothing cheaty. I would never do that. See some coal right there. Also see two skeletons. I'm not. That is a no zone. That is a no go. That is a negative ghost rider. So I'm not going to go in there anytime soon. Hopefully they won't come out anytime. Apple. Yes. Nice. I'm going to let that decay. I'm going to go check on this other tree that I chopped down. I'll make another axe in a second. All right, nothing over here. So, uh, never done a solo UHC. The two, I hear a zombie too. Where is he? Is he in there? Hopefully he's in there and not going to show up. I got to get some stone pretty soon. Where's the world border? I still can't see it, so that's good. Maybe there's a cave under me that has some zombies that I can get to and start caving, because I gotta get underground. I gotta get underground before it gets dark, and I gotta find a spot to start moving around before the world border closes in. As long as I don't dig towards the world border, I'll be okay. Alright, so I got one apple. I would like to have at least two. If I get three, that's terrific. At the moment, doesn't look like I'll be having any luck. Come on. There we go. I realize you're not supposed to be breaking stuff with your hand. It's easier to just let it decay naturally but there's I don't think that's ever been proven what did that just drop a sapling awesome all right I'm gonna grab some of this stone hopefully without hitting this patch of mobs
they're all going to see that and be like, wow, what's taking him so long? Hopefully it doesn't get dark too soon. I think, uh, I think I figured out that it's like 16 stone is a good place to start. Maybe a little bit more. Maybe I'll go for like 20. All right. 10 minutes into the episode. Where's the sun? It's starting to go down. So maybe I should just say screw it on the apples. Unless something was dropped over here. Yes. Two apples. Nice. All right. What about this guy? Nothing over here. Chop down one more tree. If I can get one more apple, I think I should be good for the rest of the game. Then I'll head over, get those pigs, and then head into a cave right as the sun is going down. All right, I gotta make a hot pocket. Alright, I'm gonna break this guy. I might see what's going on over here. Alright, he's right there. Do y'all know y'all don't know about me? Y'all can't get to me. You might. I'm not going over there. Okay, they can't get out and he's gonna start burning. Good. Alright. One more apple. I just need one more apple so I can go and kill some pigs. And we'll will actually get this UHC started. I'm not going to worry about upgrading an axe. There's really no point chopping trees after this section. Unless eventually I run out of apples somehow. Which the only way I would do that is if I needed to eat them. Hopefully I won't need to until later on. Alright. I'm spending too much time on this hill. Alright. Let me really quick stone sword. So now they know everything. <laughs> There's a plains biome over there with a lot more trees in it, but I'm I'm better off just chopping these trees and not venturing too far. Could probably cook up this pork. I'll use you for a second. I wanted to get that coal. Apple. Yes! That's three. Three right as the sun is going down. Awesome. So I may not hit that plains biome just yet. Uh, it looks like a cave entrance over there. That might be too far. I might just be better off digging down. Let me see if I can find some surface coal over here. It looks like there is. Yeah, there's some surface coal. Awesome. All right, so I got to get over there really quick. Come on, buddy. I'll head over here. World border's coming in. Oh, great. And it's getting dark. I'm about, I'm just going to go, I'm going to grab like as much coal here as I can. And then it's underground time. I spent too much, I spent way too much time on the surface. I should have been gone by now. But three apples, that's a great start. Stuff is going to start spawning. I'm going to dig down right here. All right, awesome. Let's head underground. Yeah, I know the world border is right there, but at this point I just need protection from outside stuff. All right. Nothing there. Eat this pork really quick. Looks like a ravine. I'm going to try and see what I can get. I'm going to head down here real, really, really quick. It's got to be really fast, super fast. Super fly. All right. Creeper right there. Got to stay away from him. If I can get into this cave without him seeing me, this is not a cave. Yes, it is. Awesome. Here we go. Let's do this. Iron right there. 
Sweet. I need some torches really quick. Whew. All right. This is where I screwed up last time. So. All right. I'm, I'm cool with that. I'm cool with that. I just need to block up this so nothing gets in. So, come on. Pickaxe. Okay. All right, this is a shield. That's a shield, awesome. All right, I'm gonna start digging down this way because I know that world border is right behind me. And then hopefully this will get me to a cave. I hear some piggies above me, some more coal, perfect. This will be good. This will be really good. I'm gonna close in right there, just so nothing comes out of that other cave. I realize I probably lit the whole thing up. I'm just super nervous right now. My throat is dry. So I'm probably gonna start coughing pretty soon. No big deal. I really can't leave. I'm too close to the border to leave. So. All right, let me put this here. I'm gonna start cooking the rest of this food and then we'll start digging down. I love that new furnace crackling sound. It's great. Iron, yes. Get in my belly. So I haven't been uploading videos as much as I would like to. And that's because I've been having some issues with editing stuff. Um, I'm using ScreenFlow at the moment to record this, which is what screwed me up the last UHC. But hopefully I've got a system that'll allow me to uh, get an episode finished saved and then I can start up a new one without too much hassle. All right, got to grab this food. Should be close to done. Yep. And then as soon as that's done, I'll throw this iron in. All right, that's enough for a shield, which I definitely need, and a little bit of armor, which I'll definitely need. Drink a little bit of my monster pipeline punch. All right, level thirty-nine. Okay, at least at least I'm not too far behind. Jonathan just made a sword, so I thought I was gonna be really far behind everybody else on the like items. All right, so I gotta make. I, I need an iron pick because that's gonna get me the gold when it's time and I also need to make a shield. Shield is first priority because without a shield, I am screwed when it comes to any kind of skelly or any kind of like combat. So there we go, shield taken care of. All right, let me get this back. All right, I'm still kind of close to the surface. I can hear pigs and stuff. I'm gonna make myself just another um, stone tool right now. How I don't, I don't know exactly how far away from the world border I ran, but every 20 minutes we will get an update on where on where the world border is so I'll know exactly how far I've traveled and how much farther that world border has all right so I'm at Y level 34 and I'm pretty decent length away from the world border at this point 
Um, I think I mapped it that it travels every uh, it travels 200 blocks every 20 minutes. So hopefully, if my math is right on that, it should be at about 14. No, it should be at about 1300 by the time the server mark goes. I think I think that's how it works. We'll we'll figure it out, but. I just had to check on that because this is this is about the time that we had an issue the last time with the uh, timer so I just need to every now and then I'll just need to double check that it's actually working if it gets too long if I feel like because right now my recording says 20 minutes but I started recording slightly before So hopefully, hopefully in a few minutes, we should be good. Wow, this is a big coal vein. Wow. So yeah, hopefully we'll see it. I tested it beforehand again. I double checked it. So everything should be working. The issue with it last time was I had it set for at P instead of at A, our tell raw command. So only only the closest person to uh, zero zero would have seen it, which in last case was Tolkis. So I really don't know where he was standing when he saw it. All right, I'm gonna grab all of my stuff from up here and bring it farther underground because I don't want that world border to suck up all of my stuff. All right, so I'm going to grab you. You should be done. I'm going to grab you. All right, and we're heading farther down. What Y level am I at all the way down here? I had a really hard time finding a cave this first time. So I probably should have gotten a cave that I knew was actually a cave. This might get annoying, uh, but I just need to watch it. All right, this should be good. Should be coming up on the end of episode one. If it works, that timer will go away. All right, that's it. End of episode one. So thank you all so much for watching, and we'll see where it goes from here. So awesome. All right, we survived episode one. See you next time. From the dead.